This video will be covering how to get the Power Drift mod and how to complete one of the seven Oricon principles, Power. So you can find the test while playing any mission node on Lua. Its location is completely random, so don't expect to find the room every time you load into a mission. Now the goal of the test is to charge four silver orbs that are in place within the walls. These orbs can be charged by any player that's standing on the golden floor plates underneath them. You'll know if you're charging an orb, as there will be a blue connection between you and it. If the connection has stopped, it's either because you've run out of energy, left the zone, or you've charged the orb completely. With this in mind, each orb requires 40 energy to be successfully charged. If the player runs out of energy or leaves the floor plate, the orb will reset and it will need another 40 from the player. But don't worry, as there's no official failures for the test like there are with the others. If you mess up or run out of energy, you can always return once you have enough. Now if you successfully charge an orb, it'll turn blue as an indicator and you'll have 30 seconds to charge the other three. If you're in a full squad, the easiest way to complete the test is to have each player stand on the plates at the same time. Just make sure each of you has enough energy to charge the orbs. But for those of you who aren't playing in a squad, my suggestions consist of either equipping the Energy Siphon Aura mod, so you can passively gain energy while playing throughout the mission, bringing some energy restores, or even waiting until you can activate your Focus School, which is only for those of you who chose the Nurik and have unlocked the Energy Overflow ability. Finally, the last recommendation is for those of you who have completed the War Within quest. All you have to do is use your Operator instead of your Warframe, as it'll regenerate its energy faster than it's removed. In conclusion, once all of the orbs have been activated, head to the staircase which is located in the dead center of the room, go through the portal, and receive your Power Drift mod. Anyways, that's it for the video. Hopefully I was able to help you guys out if you are having trouble, and if I did, leave a like, if I didn't, leave a dislike, and if you're looking for the other tests and guides for them, there's a playlist up on the screen that you can go to straight away. Anyway, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.